you guys, I, I'm going to give Molly the opportunity, actually, I asked her to do this, to tell a little bit about what it's like to work with me behind the scenes. Um, she's such a go-getter and she has an established business, but sometimes even though we are so established, there's little nuances in our business that maybe we didn't realize were hangups or weren't flowing the way they were supposed to flow, whatever. And sometimes it's just having somebody to talk to. So I'm going to let Molly or ask Molly to tell a little bit about what it's like to work with me. Oh my gosh. So, you know, when, when we talked, uh, when I interviewed you on my podcast, of course, we talked about something that, that Robin speaks to all of you about, which is that we can build a business without social media. And it was like everything I heard you talking about, I knew I needed it. I, it resonated with me. And the biggest thing for me that drew me to working with you was knowing that you are genuinely interested in serving your clients and in encouraging me to serve my clients in a way that is in line with who I am and what I have to offer and really making space for it. So that brought me in and, and it's been, it's been fantastic, you know, working with you, Robin, first of all, I know you're always thinking of me. I know you're praying for me and my business. And, um, and I just, it's so fantastic to know that you're always there in my corner. You're always encouraging me to make choices that feel in alignment for me, rather than just telling me what to do only from that expert perspective. And so that space is there and really just um, knowing that I can always go to you for those little things. I just feel very taken care of, very watched over and not to mention, I think we have a lot of fun personally. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes. I mean, it is laughter is the best me medicine, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. And yes. sometimes I think we have to laugh at the things we don't know or the things that we did mm -hmm. that didn't make sense or mm -hmm. whatever the case mm -hmm. may be. And sometimes it's just rambling messages on Voxer that <laughs> are really funny. This is true. This is true. Um, but I think, I mean, really, because I think that there are, I think there are a lot of business coaches out there. There are a lot of ways that I can get help and ways that I do. But, and one thing that I just, I really appreciate about you specifically is the way you encourage me to, to make sure I am bringing me into my business. Because I think it can be really easy for us as women in general to um, look to an expert over our own intuition or knowing or what we're feeling called to. And that has never been the case here. And I think it's rare and I think it matters a lot. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. That means the world to me because I, I do pour my heart and soul into everyone that I work with because it's so important for me, not only that you have this financial success, it's, it's the personal life. It's the, it's the day-to-day -day decision making. It's the things that really impact your life as a whole, plus the people that it's going to have a trickle effect on right? trickle down effect on, right? Like yes. it, it's, yeah. And at the end of the day, we're called, we have a purpose. Every single one of us has a purpose. And the more we can serve other people with a purpose, the better the world's going to be. And we need a better world right now. 